So I got my car washed. I think it's this lady here that was threatening her heart attacks. So anyway, it's Friday. Let's get the car washed. Waiting for an opening in traffic. Wasn't too bad. Oh, it looks so much nicer. My piece of shit car looks nicer. That's sad. But anyway, let's see if we can find something on the radio since the iPod's not plugged in and I don't want to be too distracted while driving. Oh, look at this guy. He's like, I'm going to walk up this hill. Jockey for position even more. Every single one of you motherfuckers are turning here. Not that difficult. Quit weaving and fighting. You're actually going to make it there quicker. Don't know where the hell you're going. If you want the money, you're going to have to do that now. You know, this is enlightened capitalism. This is not a great progressive program by any means, uh, but at least it's a bit more enlightened uh, than what our Fed has been doing. And I think uh, Merkel scores a big victory here. As I say, England is now very isolated, and uh, uh, that really is going to have a better time. But Michelle, before I get you in, Bob, where, where do you see the deal, the part where the European banks, the, the European Central Bank or Germany is going to step up to act? Backstopping of um, all the, you know, the, both the bank debt and the and the country debt. Oh no, there, there's a the heart of this. To, there's a commitment uh, to to a huge uh, fund that all will contribute. But obviously, the more uh, successful economies will have to contribute more. Uh, there, there
there's a carrot here as well as a stick. And uh, I'm not disputing your main point that the banks made the mess, and, and I, I personally don't want to bail them out. I'm just saying your point of view is that, uh, they, that somehow there has to be 